Hey, what's happening, YouTube? How's it going, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Aquaporn with me, Steve, bringing you the first place you should look if you start to notice that you're having an algae broom outbreak in your tank. <laughs> When you first get an algae bloom, first place to check back to is your water and the supply that you're using. You have an excess of nutrients in your system. So I thought something had died at first because my water parameters were saying that I had, you know, low zero nitrates, zero phosphates, but I still kept seeing algae building. I hadn't seen my pistol shrimp in a while. So I figured he may have died and that's why I had excess nutrients in the system. But then I saw him a couple days later. So that didn't answer that. And I had just put in some Chemipure Elite and some Phosgard so I knew it wasn't anything chemical. So I traced back here to my RO unit. So check back, trace back and, and check your water. And this is definitely the culprit. I just got done changing out all three filters plus my DI resin and here we go that is the old DI resin this is what it's supposed to look like it's got that nice bright green Let's see if I can get it without glare there we go nice uh, green that is definitely black now I have really hard water as a matter of fact the uh, RO unit I have recommends that I have a water softener put on and then go through the RO unit so I should have been checking my filters earlier so check your filters people regularly uh, mine recommend every six months change on the micron membrane and then the two uh, carbons as well I can't see it that well here but they are dirty they're not absolutely disgustingly filthy not like that but uh, swap those out here and uh, we'll see if this makes a difference because I'm using this in my makeup water I'm using this for my water changes so that's got to be the answer and uh, I should probably see this bloom start going away shortly once I get the new makeup water in so check your filters check your water uh, that's always a good start I may leave it go because old Kenny over at Kate Neal's channel uh, he turned me on to where I can get a free sample of that new algae I've got that coming so maybe I'll make the new algae work for it a little bit yeah I want to get the stuff out so maybe I won't make it work that hard but it'd be interesting to see if the new algae can tackle the the algae bloom that I got going on right now because BAM it happened overnight so just a short one to let you know check your filters so you don't get the that that is definitely not what you want. Um, I should get a TDS meter as well, just so I can check and see where I'm at and and that type of thing. But I'm going to just wing it. I'll get one of those eventually, and I'll just change out the media more often. Have a good one, y'all. Change your filters. Comment, rate, subscribe. <laughs> 